What difference a play in words makes for a marketing strategy that has hit home to the hearts and minds of one's target consumers? A shortened and simple rephrase of a pension program has turned into a windfall of tens of millions or roughly 40% in excess of SSS target revenue for this year. As our Rod Lagusad reports. Social Security System expects its net income to reach 140 billion pesos this year. This is higher than the agency's previous target of 100 billion pesos for 2024. Based on the data of SSS as of July, SSS net income is already at 56.7 billion pesos. SSS President and CEO Rolando Macasayet said this is members' contribution and SSS investments. He added that part of measure of SSS to achieve this is to move their branches in different parts of the country to malls to save on rent, as there is no charge here. Makasait also expects that there will be additional 2 to 3 billion pesos worth of contribution that will be collected this year. He added that this will come from 4 million new SSS members. The rebranded Workers Investment and Savings Program or WISP, now called Pension Booster, which he says is easier to understand by the public, also contributed to the higher collection. Because of our executives who, who uh, initiated this, Indeed po, the, the response was super positive. As I understand it, dati ho, the deposits for West or the pension booster was only about 40 million a month. I think we're hitting over 100 million a month already. The SSS continues to expand the number of members, such as the inclusion of barangay officials, who are not covered by the GSIS, and also the job orders and contract of service workers in different local government units. And as for the last tranche of the mandated contribution hike next year, the SSS will push through with it to keep the pension fund viable. Makasai stressed that the law will be followed. Under the Social Security Act of 2018, there will be 1% increase in the contribution of members every two years. Meanwhile, as SSS commemorates its 67th anniversary, the agency launched its enhanced logo and redesigned website, which is user-friendly and has a dedicated page for overseas Filipino workers. The SSS also honors its partners who help implement their programs, including PTV, who recognizes the best media partner in the broadcast national category at the Balikat ng Bayan Awards. This is because of the network's contribution in providing important information to SSS members, pensioners, and other stakeholders. PTV General Manager Toby Nibrida and PTV anchor Diane Carrer personally accepted the recognition. It's very important that uh, we are reminded uh, of our mandate to provide uh, adequate, immediate information that helps uh, our people at uh, bahagi ito ng uh, ating mandato na tulungan ang lahat ng mga ahensya ng ating pahamahalaan at kasama rito ang ating uh, SSS. GM Nebrida assured the network's support to SSS programs will continue. Other honorees include various collections, disbursements, and accredited agents of the SSS, plus its top employers. Rod Lugusad, from the National TV Network, for a new and better Philippines.